Hey everybody, it's Kathy Heath from KathyHeath.com and HomeAndSmallBusinessWorld.com. I'd like to talk to you today a little bit about becoming iconic and what that can mean to your business. Now, we all know what an icon is. Um, in the entertainment industry, we have icons like, oh, Michael Jackson and and Elvis Presley and in sports we have icons like Michael Jordan and Muhammad Ali we all know what that concept means but how does it apply to business the other day I was sitting and looking at my computer and I noticed how many icons I have on my desktop and it occurred to me that each one of those different icons when activated produces a different result. The icon is unique to the program that I want to access. The icon is not trying to brand itself, if you will, and be all things to all people. The icon is simply doing what it was made to do. Bring that to your business. Instead of trying to be all things to all people, focus and hone in on what your purpose is. What unique and wonderful thing do you have to bring to the marketplace? It might be that you're the florist that actually has um, a calling list and, and you call your customers to remind them that they have an anniversary or a birthday coming up if you're online. It might be that you're known for giving away free and valuable information to people. Whatever it is that you're supposed to do, that you were made to do, if you will, focus on that. Develop that. Become iconic. The research shows that if you become only 5 to 10% better at what you're really good at doing, your sales, your customers are going to go to the moon. So that's my suggestion for today. Take it a step beyond branding. Hone in and focus on what it is you're supposed to you're made to do and become an icon. Until next time, take care.